here at UC San Diego and you can see there is this rally where hundreds have gathered to stand up for science. Every single one of these people you see here behind me is a part of the science community and they're saying that they're feeling concerned about the future of research and medicine following executive actions taken by President Trump. So we are trying to say, don't take away our funding, don't censor our science, and don't affect the programs that bring a diversity of people into the field and support those people as they're starting off. This is Lisa Eiler. She's one of many UC San Diego professors trying to help students and faculty not feel alone with the news of potential cuts coming to their science programs. Now this rally comes as multiple science agencies, budgets hang in the balance. The Trump administration says cuts to agencies like the National Institutes of Health and the Science Foundation will save billions of dollars. But Lisa says the administration's actions are actually forcing students and departments to wait in the dark, not knowing if their programs are going to be cut or from the student's perspective, if they're going to be able to start their junior studies or PhD programs. Now there are rallies like this happening all across the country on Friday. I also got a chance to speak with a grad student. She's currently studying cures for Alzheimer's. So stick with us because coming up at five, we'll share how she's already seeing impacts from these funding cuts affect her research. Reporting at UC San Diego, Danny Miskell, ABC 10 News.